Fear in social situations. When you have a fear in and of social situations, you usually try to avoid being and talking to others in different ways. The fear and discomfort lead to one perhaps not daring to present or speak in front of the class, not daring to talk to peers, not eating or having coffee with others, or not daring to shop or pay in shops. It can go so far that you start staying home from school or never dare to shop in stores. To overcome your fear, you need to practice these situations. Do it step by step. Start with the easiest so that you succeed and increase the degree of difficulty gradually. Expect it to be a little uncomfortable. Here's how you can do it. Step-by-step -step training. Step 1. Write down what is nasty and rank what you are afraid of, e.g. 5 for the worst and 1 for the easiest. For example, 5. To report in front of the whole class. 4. To read a book aloud in front of the class. 3. To report in a small group. 2. To read aloud in a small group. 1. To read aloud to a person. Step 2. Now write down the positive, what you have to gain if you can cope with your fear. For example, if I manage to present in front of the class, I get better grades. Don't have to invent evasions in group work to avoid participating. Don't have to go and worry that the teacher will ask me to read aloud or present. Step 3. Now try to face your fear step by step and work your way up your ladder from 1 to 5. It may take a long time but it doesn't matter as long as it is progressing and you keep practicing. Decide how often, when, and how you are going to practice. And if you are going to ask someone for help, the first step could be to arrange with a friend to practice standing in front of the board, in front of the class together. The next step is to ask the teacher for help to create opportunities to practice reading aloud in a small group. Thanks for watching.